What's up everybody, it's your boy Meme here. Uh, so, if you saw my um, video yesterday, I do have good news. Um, my test tomorrow is now rescheduled, which I'm happy about. My test for Thursday is now gonna be on Thursday again, it's just at a different school. Uh, and I also have more good news. Um, I passed my CompTIA A plus core one exam. Um, it has a 75% passing score and I got 79.8%, which is a little spooky. Um, of course the, a pass is a pass and I still need to do the core two exam if I want to get certified, but, um, I am done with half the quiz, which is really cool. Um, I showed up, um, they, I had to show them like my arms and I had to take everything out of my pockets and I had to move my hands around my body to show that there wasn't anything in my pockets. Um, although I had my hoodie on the whole time and I was wearing a shirt that had a, that was a pocket tee. There was a, a pocket in my t-shirt and they never asked me to take my hoodie off. So I didn't, but if I wanted to, I could have put something in my hoodie pocket. Um, although I guess they would have, no, I, I could have put something in my t-shirt pocket. Um, although, um, there was a webcam looking at me the entire time I was doing the test and presumably it would have seen me take something out. Um, the test went well, it took me a couple hours to get there, which sucked, um, but you know, um, it would have been even worse if, um, <sighs> sorry, I just saw something funny, uh, but it would have been even worse if I didn't pass the test, um, I don't know. It was really weird. Of course, I knew all the questions were going to be different from the ones I studied, and they would just be like roughly similar. Um, but that doesn't remove the fact that all I studied were questions that weren't on the test. Um, I mean, they were in spirit, right? But they weren't the same questions. And for a lot of my studying, I was memorizing how like, I, I, I was like, oh yeah, the question that starts with this word has the answer that starts with this word. And that, I'm sure, I think that's how a lot of things sort of are configured in my head. Um, and so when it comes to the actual question, I'm like, you know, I'm like 60% confident for a majority of them. Um, so I bet if things turned out a little worse, I would have gotten, I would have not passed, um, which is spooky to think about. Um, and that exact reasoning will be good for tomorrow if I don't pass the second part of the exam. Uh, but hopefully I will, and I'm gonna be studying on the way there like I did today. Um, and, you know, hopefully things will go well. Um, I brought, not only did I bring my ID, but I also brought my social security number and my birth certificate, um, which was a little crazy and definitely overkill considering uh, they asked just for my ID and just a credit card or like some sort of payment card that also had my name on it. Um, and that just worked fine. Um, what else? The first like five questions were weird questions that weren't multiple choice. The rest were multiple choice, so it was like, it was 70 questions and there were about 65 multiple choice questions, but then at the beginning there were five questions and it was like, that one of them was like a floor plan of an office building and it kept saying, hey, Office 2 is always having issues with its wireless internet connection. Uh, please move two wireless access points and a microwave and, um, walkie-talkies uh, to their ideal areas to where uh, the entire office will get Wi-Fi coverage but won't be affected by the interference. They didn't say this part, but you know, presumably won't be affected by the interference that comes from a microwave or walkie-talkies. Um, and I don't know if I got that one right, but you know, uh, I, it's just stuff like that. Um, and yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, tomorrow I'm doing my second part of the test and then I'll actually be certified, but we'll see how that goes. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Bye. Oh, for breakfast, I had a bagel and two bananas. Um, I think that was it. And then for lunch, I had a double cheeseburger at McDonald's because it's cheeseburger day, world cheeseburger day or something. And they're giving, they're, they're just giving away cheeseburgers. They aren't, they're selling them for 50 cents. Um, so I got a double cheeseburger for 55 cents after tax, which I'm pretty happy about. Um, and I did that after I got certified. And then for dinner, we had baked potatoes and that was pretty good. And then I had some chocolates after that. Um, but you know, yeah. I hope everybody has a good day and yes, you do.